What's up guys, Jay here, and welcome to the next episode of the Shiny Academy Challenge. So last week we got Piblup Scraggy, and now we're going to continue on. We've only got 10 Pokemon left to go this as of now. So we're, we're doing good. We are doing good. Sorry if that was loud. <laughs> Didn't mean to be in front of the mic that much. Right. We'll get streaming is going since I forgot to do that yet. I'm going to say stream. And then, yeah. Yep, everything looks good. Apparently someone called Jojo Snuts joined. It gets it up to my guy. Jojo Snuts wins it. Apparently I've won a saint. thing up and then we're good. Alright and down. No. Damn it. Alright, so let's get the wheel up. Oh, let's ignore the adverts. Alright guys, the first hunt of tonight will be... Ooh. Esper. We shall work with that. Scrolling, scrolling, scrolling. Ah, there you are. And now we go to this one. Yep. That is very pink. Right now, all that's finally out of the way. We can actually start our shiny hunting. Right. If I remember correctly, the best place to look for it is the beach in the tropical zone. So off I go. Go over there, actually. I landed for an execute I thought was red. <laughs> now what's used for psychic types again? Or flying? Onions. Uh, 
Now, yep, there's an Esper there. But we need to save first, don't I? <coughs> Can anyone hear me okay? Let us make a sandwich. Salty and spicy. And the question is, which gender will we get? Because, as you know, Meowstic has different forms depending on its gender. <laughs> Apologies, chat, for the... Mike assumingly peeking. Right. Yeah, this is an easy sandwich. Everything's flat. Unlike cherry tomatoes. And then put a nice sparkler on top. There we are. All sorted. Mm. Yeah, a little smudge on my glasses. Spicy! I am a master sandwich maker. There. I did the trick. Oh, of course, it starts to rain. Now I think it's gonna be extra laggy. Alright, let's go for something pink. Oh, we could get Meowstic as well. I have to look out for yellow and pink now then. So I have to go for bright colors then. Actually, would you count pink as a warm color or a cool color? Because usually you assert you put pink with bright colors. But when you think about it, pink is made from a cool color as well. Oh, that's gonna mess with me for a while now, that. If only I had an amazing artist in the stream. <laughs> yes, I'm talking about Tori. Uh, it's not as lagging as bad as when I'd be a, if it was in the water. Ugh. That one kind of made Lapras a bit of a rough one. But yeah, um, as far as when it comes to my health, I'm starting to perk up a bit, so I should be able to get back into the rotation of the channel's schedule. If anything, it would be depending on how bad the cough is. Because, again, as I said during the last Persona stream, I don't think people want to hear me cough and sneeze throughout the entirety of it. <laughs> so that might depend on future streams on how bad my cough is, on if I'll actually go ahead and stream something. Of course, when it stops, stops, then yeah, we'll be fine. But I can't say for certain how bad or good my throat will be. Yeah, th th this is a better hunt compared to what happened yes last week. A lot easier to pinpoint the espers and meow sticks. Uh. 
Honestly, I have to admit, that period where I was just too ill to do anything was horrible. I was so bored out of my mind, but if I, I knew that if I was going to do something, it would make me feel worse. So I, I was just stuck in one heck of a loophole. My temperature was fluctuating as well, so I couldn't stay comfortable. That's just a regular Esper. <laughs> This will be my first shiny Esper, actually. Maybe I should organize my collection and see what I don't have. Because I do have a lot of shinies. And I can't exactly remember on my tongue of how much of the decks I've got. I definitely know what one Pokemon I don't have. Being the Golden Go line. I still didn't like the way they implemented that shiny. A temporary raid event with very low odds. And Mike has one. I've only seen it a couple of times, but still. <laughs> Yeah, it is just that waiting game again, I guess. If anything, it's just struggling to find something to talk about. I did see something weird though, because um, I went onto the Gamescom stream, it just didn't look like it was trying to be Gamescom. Just some indie games. Like, I'm not saying they don't deserve to be presented. Trust me, I'd prefer an entire like Gamescom thing dedicated to indie games. It's just usually Gamescom is usually filled with AAA releases or like big hotshot titles. But I didn't see anything like that. Either that, or I was just misreading the Gamescom stream altogether. It was mainly because the adverts were in different languages during the stream. It was weird. I understand Gamescom yearly is ha usually you yearly usually happens in Germany, but I couldn't tell if it was German in the adverts. I don't think it was. Yeah. I just don't know what to say. <laughs> about this specifically, I do have things to talk about, I guess. I think over the past few weeks, I think we've been a bit lucky with the temperature. When it comes to summer this year. Because most of June was completely nice and cool. And I'll admit, at the end of June, it's starting to warm up, unfortunately. <laughs> but I'll admit, the last couple of days, it's been nice. Hmm. <laughs> nope. It looks like a very bright pink. If anything, it looks like the one that... It's all gonna be obvious when I find it. Where 
little cat. Oops. <laughs> Excuse me. Oh, whiplash. Mm, no, nothing there. Nope. None of them. Uh, yeah, no, not you. Nope. I don't have that much of an experience from Meowstic, I'll have to admit. It's kind of a meh option when it comes to power. And it's kind of forgettable in Gen 6 eyes. I think it's that's mainly down to the fact that Mega Evolution kind of boosts the popularity of other psychic types, being Alakazam, God of War, Slow King, and a sl Slow Bro. I mean, <laughs> so like some of the psychic types in the generation didn't really get a chance to shine. Delphox is a good example of that, and so is um, Meowstic. Oops. How much time has the sandwich got? 90. Yeah, we got ages. We'll find it. Especially the map we're seeing. I didn't even see that one. Just give him a chance to despawn so new ones come out. Oh, there you go. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. A shiny meow stick. And it's marked as well. Stand in the ball. Oh, they got rid of the animation where it flipped its ears up. That's the main like reason it's got it flopped down. <laughs> Alright, you're being difficult, aren't you? Obviously, I'd kill it. I'll try repeat ball next. There we are. Now I gotta switch uh, these over. Let's have a look at the um, 
Mark. No, oh, yeah, I can't, man. The Dawn Mark. Meowstick the Early Riser. That's nice. That's nice. <laughs> Another job well done. Right. There, and we'll hide this one until we know what we're hunting for next. <laughs> now, uh, as the rules would state, um, we'll keep the ass sandwich going considering this was the first one, and then we'll look for what we're looking for next when this is done. We shall save though. And there's no other, psych other psychic types we need to look for on the list. So it's just Meowstic right now. Or Esper. You know what, F it. Nah, the guy said that. Let's go for the next one. Alright, the guys. Next hunt for tonight will be... Go on, go on. Yes! Trap Inch. I've been waiting for this one for ages. <clears throat> right. Trap Inch's uh, model's a bit difficult to put on here. There we go. Oh, I'm so excited about this hunt. It's one of my dragon boys. Yay!
This should be the good area to look for trap inches. I think ground's the way to go, but obviously we might have to run into might run into right horns and right on like we did when we did right horn. Um, I think they ever wanted, I think they wanted ham, didn't they? Let's go for salty and sour. Now's not a good time for the ham to be slippery. Whoa. It's a big hamloni. I'm gonna be stupid. Hey! My sandwich skills have improved. Next hunt begin. And when I say that, the best part is we're not just looking for Trapinch. We're looking for Vibrava and Flygon. Where is best boy? Hot topic, Flygon is better than Garchomp. That's cool seeing Vibrava with his wings tucked away. Oh, look at all the little beans. Look at all the walking beans. Where is you?
Where is my special little walking bean? Stream Raiders is ready to go and I'm gonna assume no one joined it. Even need to look for orange wings or green walking bean. Where is your walking bean? Hmm. Oopsie. The being wait, 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 did you say five five units? Five boys have come to my aid. Ooh. Not very nice of them. And I'm starting to sound weird, I should stop it. <laughs> Apologies, apologies for the yawning. As Flygon, my boy. Well, boy, yeah, yeah. oh, Flygon's aggressive. <laughs> yeah. Dragon, this is, this is kind of mesmerizing. Knowing what Flygon's based on. The Ant Lion. I think that's its name. I think it's got some connection to what's the word? Uh, dragonflies. <sighs> it will be an exciting day when the dragon type finally gets a bug type to call its own. Uh, oh. 
R O. Yeah. I have to be honest, guys. I've been wanting to do a Pokemon playthrough for a while now. And sorry for that background noise. But the main problem I'm having is I'm having a hard time deciding which one. I can't do Gen 1, 2, and 3. Because I don't have them. Without emulation. I'm a bit off about Gen 4, because of how slow it can be. Gen 5 is the closest thing to me saying yeah to. But I can't decide what Pokemon I want to use. Gen 6, I've kind of gotten off. I've only recently played because of um, the whole friend code situation as in the middle of spring. You know, when I'm... Um, the 3DS's online services was cut off. Gen 7, I'm worried about the endless tutorials. Gen 8, I can't do anything with until I've done something in Shield. And obviously, Gen 9's bit thrown a bit shade of me recently because of the quality. <laughs> Nope, none of them. This one be playing hard to get. Yep, that's what I was worried about the right horns and the right ons. Um, still trying to figure out what to say while I'm still looking for the little bean boy. Bench. 
<laughs> Apollo G for the yawning. What's annoying is by Brava goes orange like Trap Inch does when it's shiny and Trap Inch goes green like by Brava. It's a nice motif but it doesn't help when it comes to getting mistaken. I'll say it now guys, this job can be hard, being a streamer. It's just so hard to come up with something on the top of your head. <clears throat> Especially when you've got no one to talk to. Trust me, if there was someone in this chat now, this might be a bit more entertaining. Come on, Mr. Beanie Boy. You come with me. You'll be raised like king. Ah, Asha, long time. How's it been? Welcome to a little walking bean hunt. <laughs> I've been alright. Caught on the for a little bit. Had to have a break thanks to that. Now I'm just looking for little trap inches. Got me out sick earlier. Contemplating whether to go partner. Questioning if I can make it. I don't know. How about you? You been alright? How far are you from uh, hacking the Pentagon? Uh, I kid, I kid. Where is green walking bean machine? Not you. Uh -uh. Oh, I forgot our stream raiders. Oh wait, did that happen halfway? Um, oh yeah, my five, yeah. I forgot to bring my banana arrow. Wait, you eat bananas, right? Or is that an offensive stereotype?
Oh, I didn't see you, man. I got stuck in the ad jail. The Pentagon is just a boring government building, so I bother. Fair enough. I thought it was something like uh, the headquarters of the FBI or something. Or is it Area 51 you're looking at? The bean is being very hard today to find. Nope, no. Oh, there's that. No. Eleven minutes for this first sandwich. Oh, good. Them too. No, 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 not them too. I'm loving you. I won't be. I would bet everything to watch for boring military bullshit. I don't care about. <laughs> I don't know anything um, that patriotic cesspool has to begin with, so. I think the only thing you'll probably get out of it is a secret recipe of a Kentucky Fried Chicken or the Krabby Patty secret formula. Oh, I hate it when this game lags like this. Oh god, hell yeah, shiny fly gone. I'll take that. Yeah. We're getting evolved. Of all form of Pokemon today, are we? Hey, don't act so disappointed. I'm good for you. You'll be treated like a king, my good man. On a hot take, Flygon is better than Garchomp. I have shiny charm in this time, by the way. I usually just wander aimlessly for an hour. Hey, I tried to get at least three shinies per stream, so, so far we're in good uh, timing for that. Got an hour to go. And now we've only got nine Pokemon left in the challenge to get until we're done. I know people have done this specific challenge a lot sooner, but... Than when I did it in, but... I don't know. You're being difficult, aren't you? Oh, that's it. You want to live in luxury, innit? <laughs> Alright, let me sort out the overlay. I didn't check if it had a mark, by the way. No, I didn't. Another job well done, I guess. Oh, I've been waiting for that one for a while. I'll hide that.
That should do. That's yeah, so it looks like it's hovering. Okay, uh, yep. That's it all tied up. A Pokemon to go. Alright, we'll get Stream Raiders done and then we'll uh, move on to the, our third hunt for today. Oh, which ones did you get? Ooh, Kenny Boom and... I don't know. <laughs> Might be playing Baldur's Gate after the stream as well, so... Ooh, Kenny Boom got the wins. Oh, Persona 3, nice. And what a surprise, you got Soul Hackers. <laughs> uh, I'm sorry, I just find that funny that a hacker got Soul Hackers. Time for a boss. Could definitely use the help on this one. All right, next hunt, next hunt. All right, guys, next hunt for tonight will be. This is going to get a lot more painful now. <sighs> For the people who don't know, you'll find out soon enough why this is a bad thing. We might have to use a outbreak skip as well to get the right thing. Is um, Soul Hackers like uh, a Dark Souls game, from what I've heard? This is going to be painful. You know, that whole vibe of, um, you will die a lot sort of thing. But yeah, I'm, I'm gonna die a, I'm gonna die a lot trying to flip and get this so I don't... thing is, there are a lot of really bad shinies left in the list that I'm concerned about. Let's fly on the floor just in case we get a random shiny. I think the way I'm seeing it when it comes to future Pokemon content, at least until ZA comes out, I don't know what's going to happen with that. After I've done the challenge, my next step will be to shiny hunt Quaxley. And then after that, then that's it. That There's nothing else I really get out of Skull and Violet when it comes to Twitch content. So I think it'll either be messing around with stuff like uh, Poke Rogue, Infinite Fusion, 
I think I might even get um, a ROM hack emulator going. Soul Hackers 2 literally has a difficulty where you can incapable of dying. Oh. Not saying I'd appreciate that, it's just that's a bit surprising. I'll maybe have a look at it. I would I wouldn't mind like I I do have a roster of games to play, it's just I should really broaden my what's the word? Range of games really. You can like you can die, but if you die, just say yes because you're gonna full state damage. Oh. So that they keep the damage that you provided them. Right, we'll do the sandwich out here because for some reason when you do it out inside the cave it's basically losing your eyesight 10% of the time. Like, much like how in Legends you can cheese every noble by continuing and... Oh, yeah, yeah. I only did that once and that was with Avalog. Like, I like Legends, but until you beat Reach Volo, it's not that hard. Oh, that flipping cheating Giratina of his. Let me count. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven. We're gonna have one Pokemon on its own. <laughs> yeah, that'll be the only time you ever say Avalug is brutal, because outside that boss fight, it's flipping dog shit. <laughs> Come on. <coughs> It has a special defense that under 50. You could kill it with Ember. Right. I think it's Yellow Be Bell Peppers for electric types. Uh, salty and sweet. I remember I went into a blind panic with a Suian Electrode though. Man, that was so intense having to dodge all those explosions and then that pulsing energy wave that always tracked you. Oof. I think I might have forgot to save. Which is bad. Because I don't want to risk losing that Flygon. Personally, I think you could play Digimon Cyber Sleuth. P-L-Z-I-B-E-G. What's that? Oh, please, I beg. Canadian dollars. Right, uh, 
Now we need to start doing that really annoying task. Well, we have to reset the biomes. This could either be a few minutes or the rest of the stream. Um, this is going to be a bit rough, this. <laughs> it's the Digimon entry most similar to Pokemon. Complete edition is two games in one. 60 hours minimum. Hmm. Something to consider, to be honest. Yeah, th this is going to be a bit. So any conversation you can bring up is greatly warranted. I thought... I remember getting a Digimon game at some point. When you are horsing up. But it was on a um, PlayStation 4. Whoops. Milsery, Finion. I want to do that Poplio, but we can't. <sighs> this is going to be painful. I think the only other major anime, uh, Collectathon Hunt series I've ever touched before was Yu-Gi-Oh! And even then it was only on Master Duel. And I did have a number of decks, but every time I got one built it just got power crept. Heck, there was even one time I had, like, Cyber Dragon. Oh, I love that deck. Just get Cyber Dragon Infinity going and that's it, you're sweeping. And you don't even have to grind if you don't want it because you just leave the game open and go to bed. It'd probably be damaging to your device though. He's doing quillfish. Rowlet. I don't even know why I'm looking over there. I need to stick with plus all over here. Maybe it'd be more effective if I went into the cave. Yeah, hang on then. Yeah, so not a single puzzle. Not really. It took my old switch six years to of n near never turning off to Rick and battery. Right. 
Now I'm in that biome that it spawns in. It might have a more ch higher chance to show up. <laughs> First one. Ha! You can't make that up, can you? I don't know that the switch is known to have a bad battery. Now here comes the fun part. Genocide. People complaining about battery usually do so because it's not very long. Yeah, that was a good point. Like with Breath of the Wild, it was probably a gas guzzler. I score. Y you're joking, right? Again, it's a consideration. I'm not saying no to it. It's just I do have a list of priorities right now. Mainly a haircut. That one looks very similar. Nope. This is gonna be such a pain on my eyes, cause look at how bad the difference is on that um, plus all on the screen. <laughs> Apologies for the noise. It's, it's alright, I, I just didn't understand what you meant. Make me more mice. Might be up here. By the way, that's a fag, my way. No, no, no. It's... Uh, trust me, I get it. When your Wi Fi gets bad, it gets bad. It's the most annoying thing on the planet, isn't it? I think the more annoying part about when you have bad Wi Fi. Is it tries to be good? I'm still contemplating on whether I should push to partner, by the way. Cause, like, I'll have a look at my progression to partner. I've got the right hours and time and days of the week I'm doing it on. It's just average viewership. Um, I don't know if I should push for it or not. 
I don't even need to hack the two free because I'm not so bad I don't even need to lag switch. I don't know, like lag switching is kind of frowned upon. I not I'm not saying you you're in the wrong for doing it, it's just I don't know. Like don't you have to on purpose they have bad Wi Fi to make it work? Or is there like some hacking software out there that can make your Wi-Fi bad on purpose? And yeah, it's it's not a good thing, is it? It's I think it's technically class as a form of cheating. I think that's something I don't like though from the regard of the developers of games because for those people who have bad Wi-Fi and can't fix it and then because of that they disconnect, they still get punished for leaving. That's kind of not fair on that regard. Like the other day, for some reason my LAN cable was playing up on me. And because of that, I left free games out of nowhere. Actually, now I got suspended for like half an hour. Right, that's um, 60 plus souls uh, killed. So now I just gotta <laughs> keep an eye out for one with not very much of a good amount of a difference. Help me. Um, I don't think that's it. That does look like it. Oh, this is so pain. Right, hang on. I'm getting up a reference image so I know what I'm looking for. to be free. Right. So it literally just looks like a dark and plusel. I just thought it's the main reason, um, like, you know, people are just so losers and they don't want to lose lose, so they leave the game before you can lose it. And obviously that leaves a situation where the people who are actually trying to play the game lose out. Why does mining have such a terrible shiny? Whoops. 
Not, not mine and plus all. But yeah, mine and mine was more noticeable. Like it was a different shade of blue, wasn't it? Nope, they're all the same. Nope. Nope. <laughs> This is painful. I say, I'll tell you, Ash, this is painful. Nope. They're the same colors. Nope. Yeah, none of them. Nope. Nope. Maybe? Nope. But all the same, it's, it's just not fair that the people who are just... The, the innocent people who just generally have a bad internet connection. They, there should be a way for them to identify closely that... On whether someone is manipulating their internet connection or not. No, that's the same. Nope. Oh, uh. no. I want to bash my head on the desk. Now that isn't fair. Nope. 
No. Maybe that one? No. I want to kill every single mine in here at this point. I need plus all. That's uh, stream is ready to go. Twelve minutes to go until the sandwich runs out. <laughs> the anxiety man in my head is starting to whir. Tell him to stop it. Six units. I think I might be able to get rid of the boss. Obviously, we'll check when the sandwich is up. I can't lie, I'm actually getting quite nervous, Ash, about this. It's like a proper dark red. Whoops.
up. Maybe that one? No. Come on. Something's got to give. That is just mean they the spawning minings. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. No, you're not the same. I mean, you are the same, which is a bad thing. It is a case of as soon as I, um, it shows up and it's next to another one, I'll tell what it is when it's here. I think it's just also down to the fact that I'm just being getting very unlucky. F 
three minutes left to go, Jesus. Come on, game, please be nice to me. That means I can't kill any more otherwise the outbreak will end so the only way to properly tell if it's a mining shiny is to interact with it which is going to take longer I hate everything about this Pokemon. Nope. One minute to go. Dang it. Is that it? No, same color. Mm, this is torture. And that's the sandwich done. Alright, here's what we're going to do. We're going to try and do the rest of the hunts without the sandwich. Mainly because we don't have enough time to start another sandwich. <laughs> Which means there's a chance we may have to roll plus on to next week. Which is going to be absolute torture because it's mining. 
I mean plus one. Damn it! I keep making that mistake. How does this even pass off as a shiny? Is that one it? No. My eyes are hurting something rotten, chat. This looks like it. No. I want to burn every last flipping plusle to the ground.
No. No. Come on. I, I gotta have something. Come on. Please. I'll put you next to your useless sibling. Maybe that one? No. I don't know. <laughs> I want to absolutely destroy this thing. It shouldn't even exist, really. Yeah, I think um, I'm just pinning on the point of, yeah, this ain't gonna work out. Yeah, this ain't gonna happen this week, is it? Worth a shot. It looked like it. It really does look like it. Hmm. 
I'll check that one if that's not it, then I'm gonna have to leave it. Mm -hmm. Another annoying hunt to take over to next week, I guess. There's nothing else to do right now. We'll get stream readers on done and then we'll call it a day. What's that? War Beast. Cool, it's like a bear. And yeah, um, unfortunately, we did not get everything we wanted today. But hey, we got Meowstic and we got Flygon. That's a plus. But yeah, speaking of plus, I hate that I've had to hunt for this thing. So we're going to have to do what we did with mining where we'll give it another shot at the beginning of next week's stream. But if I don't find it after the first sandwich, we'll put it on, on hold and look for something else. And frankly even more pissed off at Plusle and Mining now because I remember Mining was annoying and I remember now that Plusle is going to be annoying again. I hate these two Pokemon. They're in my top 10 least favorite Pokemon now because of this. But anyway, thank you all for watching today. If you like the, the content I just showed you today, please consider liking and subscribing and commenting on your favorite bit of the VOD. But for now, uh, that'll be it for today and I'll see you all next time. Mm -hmm.